On behalf of the Amani National Congress Party, I wish to take this opportunity to convey our deepest condolences to the people of Tanzania following, following the demise of uh, uh, President John Pombe Magafuli. It is very sad that um, we have lost him. Just a few months after he had been re-elected for his second term uh, by the people of Tanzania. We therefore want to take this opportunity to show solidarity with them uh, and to really encourage them that uh, during this trying moment, let it also be a healing moment uh, for the people of Tanzania uh, who have come out of a fairly controversial uh, election. Uh, but nevertheless, uh, what is important is that we show respect uh, for uh, President Magafuli because uh, he had come out very strongly uh, to anchor his messages around the issues of a strong economy, issues of integrity, issues uh, that fight against corruption. He stood, he anchored his principles against the fight on corruption. Uh, this was a very, very uh, solid message. Um, he wanted efficiency in the public service. Um, he wanted a, serv a public service that works for uh, the people of, uh, of uh, Tanzania. And uh, he was very pragmatic. He was somebody who would come out of his office and go out to the field uh, to make sure that he's following up on issues that touch on the ordinary uh, Tanzanian. So we can only say may his soul rest in eternal peace. And we are confident that the people of Tanzania will live in accordance with their constitution during the transition period so that uh, they can move forward in a peaceful uh, way uh, so that uh, Tanzania can continue to be a leading light uh, in this region. Thank you. Kwa niaba ya chama cha ANC, mimi ningependa kuchukua fursa hii kutuma risala zetu za Rambi Rambi kwa wenzetu wenyeji wa muungano wa Jamhuri ya Tanzania baada kufuatia kifo cha Rais John Pombe Magufuli ambaye uh, ametuacha mimi ningependa kuchukua fursa hii uh, kusema kwamba uh, tumepoteza kiongozi shupavu ambaye alikuwa amejitolea na alikuwa na msimamo ambao ulikuwa umeheshimika msimamo ambao ulikuwa wa kupigana na ufisadi msimamo ambao ulikuwa unataka uh, watu wa heshimu uh, wadhifa wao wala ambao wana kazi za umma wajibikie wananchi vilivyo bila mapendeleo na bila ubaguzi uh, rais magafuli pia uh, hakuwa na ile hali ya kusema kwamba mambo ya, ki, ya bureaucracy isumbue wananchi alikuwa akitoka katika uh, nafasi yake na kwenda kule mashinani ili kuhakikisha kwamba anataka ku kuhakikisha ku, kwamba wale ambao wana jukumu la kuhudumia wananchi wanafanya hivyo vilivyo bila uh, shida zozote bila uh, tushawishi yoyote kwa hivyo alikuwa amejitolea muhanga uh, na sisi kama wa Kenya uh, tunaungana na ndugu zetu kusema kwamba uh, uh, piga ambalo umelipata pia sisi hapa katika taifa letu tunalisikia na tuko na wao na langu tunakuhimiza kwamba Tanzania imekuwa ikionyesha mfano mzuri uh, wa kuzingatia katiba wakati wa mpito tangu wapate uhuru wamekuwa wakizingatia katiba yao na hii ndio wakati wa kwanza ambapo uh, rais wa taifa hilo uh, anakufa akiwa mamlakani 
na lengo letu ni kuhimiza kwamba vile wamekuwa wakizingatia katiba wakati zile za nyingine watazingatia katiba saa hizi wakati huu ili wakati wa mpito uwe wakati ambao hatutaona furugu yoyote ama shida yoyote katika uh, Tanzania na mengine yote uh, najua Mwenyezi Mungu atawasaidia asanteni sana